We're here at Costa Hall in Geelong for the Dr Jane Goodall Youth Symposium and today we're going to hear not only from Jane Goodall herself but also from a number of youth around Geelong and the region. These youth have been involved in sustainability and environmental initiatives and taking action to improve the environment for people and for animals. Conard College has been the co-organiser with the Jane Goodall Institute of Australia. Jane Goodall has come to Australia for her 80th birthday celebrations and she's been here to talk to us about her Roots and Shoots program which is an initiative for the youth to get involved with community activities to make a better world and she's also challenged the students and the children and the people here today to ensure that they take action to, to make the world a better place because we've got the responsibility and the opportunity to, to make the world a better place. Unfortunately the world is in a mess. It's uh, in a mess as far as the environment is concerned. We're in the middle of the sixth great extinction. We're destroying habitats. Our human population is growing. There is massive poverty uh, and on the other hand there's a lot of greed. So there's an awful lot of work to be done to try and change attitudes and make this a better world. It's not really surprising that so many of the young people I meet have lost hope in the future because the future is grim. But if our young people lose hope, we have no hope. And when people say to me, but why are you spending so much time with youth, with children? It's because if, you know, all the efforts that I and others make to try and conserve species, to protect habitats, you know, fighting with politicians and invested business interests. It's all useless if new generations aren't going to be better stewards than we've been. I was really amazed by how gentle and quiet and how powerful Jane Goodall was when she spoke and how warm she was and her humanity and her connectedness to the people around her, the audience, but also the people who've been dealing with her was a revelation really. It was, it was a real inspiration to meet her and a bit of a highlight for me I must say. There are a lot of expenses obviously when you take a, an important international guest like Jane Goodall and so it was a real highlight for us to be able to provide the Geelong community and the broader communities uh, to come along and to hear an inspirational speaker and we wouldn't have been able to do that without the assistance of Geelong Connected Community so we thank them very much for their assistance today. It was Mahatma Gandhi who said, the planet can provide enough for human need but not human greed. And people today are using the natural resources as though they have no end, as though they're infinite, and they're not. They're finite. And if we don't realize this and learn to live within the planet's means, then it's a very, very sad lookout for our great-great-grandchildren. <laughs>